video, I'm going to be showing you exactly how I automatically sync my audio and video inside of Final Cut Pro X. What you can see here is I have my internal camera footage, and we're just going to go ahead and quickly play back and let you see what that sounds like. You can tell the audio inside the camera is really not that good. And then I have my external footage, which was recorded with a uh, lavalier style microphone and my Zoom H6 Handy Recorder. Okay, we are now recording audio on the Zoom. What we want to do is just select both of these two clips because I know this audio and this video actually go together. You want to right click and just find uh, synchronize clips. A little dialog box is going to come up here. You can name this whatever you'd like to. Typically, I just leave mine whatever it is and hit OK. And you can see this was a smaller clip, so it did it pretty quickly, but even longer clips don't take that long. But what you'll want to do is just drag this into your timeline. And then typically, if you have your audio recording first, which is what I do, and it'll just be a black screen until the actual camera audio comes on. And then you'll just want to kind of trim off the edges of your clip where the audio doesn't actually sync because you don't really need any of that anyhow. And then what you're going to want to do is make sure you go over to your little sound uh, icon thing here. And when you go down to audio configuration, you're going to see a couple of different things. You're going to see dialogue one and dialogue one with a number two beside of it. So what you can do is either hit storyline and you can see both of the dialogues here. So this looks like this is the camera audio and then connected is the other audio. So if you're unsure of which audio is which, you can uncheck each of these boxes one at a time, listen to the audio. Obviously, whichever one sounds better is going to be the audio that you want to use. And then from that point forward, you'll have a clip just like this. So as you can tell, the audio inside the camera is really not that good. But the audio using the lavalier style microphone running through the Zoom H4n actually sounds very good. I really hope today's video helped you out. And if it did, be sure to show the channel some love and support by just dropping a like, commenting down below how much this is going to help you out in the long run, and subscribe if you want to see more content just like this. But as always, be sure to create something new today.